Hey guys, Stake here for Games Defined and this quick tip is going to be on creating a second UV channel. So second UV channels are usually uh, used for game models where if you import them into a game engine they're going to need a light map which is when when light hits your model if if your UV channel isn't set up properly you can get loads of weird lighting problems so um, this is this is going to sort it so once you've got your model it uh, unwrapped and everything with the U unwrap UVW modifier you're going to come down to open UV editor and hopefully see your UVs laid out then what you're going to do is you're going to click up on the map channel uh, this will come up if you're in Max 2015 something different I think will come up in the previous version so I'm um, just click abandon and you'll get something that's completely bad uh, so we don't want this looking like that because that will come up with all sorts of problems so if you go back to the first map channel you want something similar to this so what you can do is you can actually save out this UV by just clicking save just save it anywhere yeah that will do once you've done that come up to map channel 2 again press load load the file now in this channel it doesn't matter if some of the elements are bigger than the others so in the first map channel which are used for the texturing you know if if you want it looking at its best all the elements need to be in scale with each other and with this it doesn't matter at all really because you're not ex you're not exactly setting up any textures so there's going to be no stretching or anything so you just set it up however works so you do you don't really need to do that much in this case so yeah once you've act once you're happy with it then you come out of that and collapse too uh, and then that's it it's pretty much sorted from there but to check it you just you can just go back to the modifier open the UVW editor and go to map channel 2 and then this is it will hopefully save and then you know just go back to that and click abandon and that's completely sorted now in uh, I don't know about any of the other game engines but I use UDK which is the Unreal Development Kit and when you import a model you'll see you'll say this is the window up here there will be some information and it will say UV channels 2 and that they, that is because you have sorted out your second UV channel for your light mapping so yeah that's it that's all that needs doing it's really simple so hope you learnt something and I'll see you in the next video <laughs>